sure I've got a Ukrainian folk costume in here somewhere. <laughs> you get it, me, Ted? Do not call me this. Sister Olga locked me in the cellar. She gave me darkness. Fuck. I gave her darkness. A little more of the back coming. Yes, Rachel, of course. So pretty you are. So much money. I want to tell you something. This is really important. These are like... <laughs> Excuse me. It's off. You like my hair, Paul? Uh, very pretty, dirty, sexy Rachel. Like my mother. Could I have babies too? Why? I'm very good with children. You wanna join us? We're nicer than we look. I think you bad gods. Ma. You are my candy girl. And you've got me wanting you. Are you being rude, you little skank? I'm not quite sure I heard what you said. Break my finger! Don't be baby, I only sprain. Next one I break. You need what? me wanting you! Oh my god, Helena, stop! Oh, honey! You have real pretty eyes. You have a nice hat. A very nice red face. All mangoes are golden. Nothing golden is cheap. Conclusion. All mangoes are cheap. Where are these mangoes? Where are these mangoes? I would like to see these mangoes. The doctor asked a question. I met your brother. He's ugly. Okay. I fell in love with a boy called Jesse. But after birth, I think he had to go to war and become a tow truck driver. Thick, so you really got to put your back into it. Sister Allison has good taste. Yeah, well, she's very crafty. In men. What? What? Tell me your voice. <coughs> I have a cold. Yeah, yeah. It's it's one of those really bad ones that messes with your syntax. You have meat on your bones. You're strong like baby ox. This I like. We know where Oscar and Gemma go to school. Did you threaten babies? It's not usually this thick when Allie does it. So maybe we need two baby ox. You have funny man, don't make him Hey, let's go. Let's just get out of here, okay? Hey! You should not threaten babies. I'm gonna talk to my wife. Two babies. Honey, I gotta go. Well, you know, what did you do? I got refund. Sister shot me. How is she even alive? <gasps> Who is Helena? I am the original. Helena's unlike any other character that you really get to work with. Who are you? Family. She's just the black sheep. And then Tatiana really brought extra dimensions to that. You're my twin sister. I don't want to be your sister, meathead. She was kind of the yang to Sarah's yin. It just sort of works because that's what that combination does, and that's what makes her so compelling and so exciting and so, so rich.
And it's a wicked experience having Tat so volatile as Helena. There's less rules to Helena as far as what she will do in a social situation or in any kind of situation. She's a little more unpredictable. She relishes. You know, she takes pride in making you flinch. You know, and sometimes she'll make you flinch and then kill you. <laughs> but sometimes she just needs to make you flinch. She just needs to get the reaction out of you. She's just a bit of a, of a creature onto her own. She sort of has elements of, of comedy to her and darkness and horror and all of these things. And she's kind of a really fun. I, I love playing her. I love her. You are all I have now. Helena sort of has been transforming a lot over the past, this past season. <laughs> the first time we saw her last season, she was kind of a killer. I'm supposed to kill you too. We had the concept that this psycho, this villain in season one would, would, uh, would become sympathetic. Father says he wants you to join our family. I've already got the family. But you're barely even human. I have a twin, Sastra. This season, I think because of how Kira affected her last season and how Sarah affected her last season, we start to really kind of de dismantle her and we see this whole other thing. And Helena's become another person entirely. <sighs> Hello, Sastra. Good to see you. And I think that probably was always there, but it's lied dormant for most of her life. Please. Sastra, I need your help. Don't send me back. I was married. I think he took something from inside of me. I hate to say this, but as much as anyone sees it on film, to see Helena in person is just, it's, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy, and it's, it's, it's spooky, but intriguing. Oh, shit. The way Tatiana sort of just lives in it is, is fantastic. Orphan Black, all new, Saturdays at 9, only on BBC America.